Australia has a, has a lot of innovation in the ICT sector uh, through the universities and also to the two, two main research centers, NICTA and CSIRO. And when you look at the, the kind of research we do, it's basically a lot driven by Australia, where it is and what it, what it, how big it is. And so we do a lot of research on analytics, you know, data analytics or you know, optimization, because we have very large supply chains. We have a very complex you know, uh, energy system. And uh, so, so these things have to be optimized. They have to be, they, they have to be very efficient. And a lot of the research that we do is in that space. How can we make supply chains, logistics systems a lot more efficient? Public transportation is also one of the other areas. Australia has some of the very high quality universities and they do fantastic research in ICT sector. And I come from one of those universities. We do a lot of innovation in ICT related. The way I look at uh, innovation is uh, ICT as an enabler to solve real world problems. And in that area, what we have done, there's a lot of work going on in the sensor technology area, in uh, uh, wireless areas, and many, many others. And we are looking at how the technology or the innovation that is developed in Australia can change real or address real problems that is facing our community, like transport, like uh, climate change, like uh, in transport, you look at congestions, like healthcare. So we are trying to address these big challenges using uh, some of the technologies and innovations that is uh, taking place through universities and research institutions like uh, NICTA and CSIRO. You need to think about the way the, 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 ICT, the ICT companies in India are you know, very large company, very efficient in actually delivering uh, outstanding products, outstanding integrations of various components. And what they do well is taking an idea and productizing. And what we do well is actually coming up with new ideas and showing a proof of concept. And so one of the ways we want to collaborate with the, with, with the ICT in India is actually you know, coming up with new ideas that can actually increase their, their businesses, their, their market share, and letting them productize uh, what we are doing. Because we are not in the biz business of productizing, but the ICT in India is you know, world leading in that particular aspect. I mean, put it this way, India, the large companies in India, they know the market. We've got the technology, we've got the knowledge, and if you bring the two together, then we can really address these big problems, and that's what we're trying to do. Develop new solutions, new technologies, new research in Australia, and bring this with some of the large Indian companies, and take it to the marketplace. Uh, so that's, that's the, I think that's, how, that's a game changer. That's what will solve some of the problems. And I think partnership between academia, research institutions, and industry becomes very important together with the government, because I think there are three pillars, right? Academia, industry, and government all coming together to solve real world problems. And that's what we are in. And that has been one of our reasons for coming up here. Yeah. Looking at what we could do with Indian companies and how they could take some of our innovations to the marketplace. So one of the things that you need to understand is that Australia is a huge country, right? So the supply chains are huge. The public transportation problems are happening in highly densely populated you know, cities. And when you look at the rest of the world, that's where it's going. When you look at India, that's also highly dense, you know, highly populated cities and so on, large supply chain. So in a sense, Australia for us is a test bed for the rest of the world. And so if we develop prototype for Australia, you know, ICT companies in India can actually take these prototypes and you know, you know, productize them and, and apply them to the rest of the world. So I think you know Australian companies are very good in innovating. So the, the, the ICT sector in Australia is good in, in, in coming up with new ideas. And I think they should engage with the Indian companies in saying, okay, so we have these great ideas, how do we scale it? Uh, because all, when you look at the ICT sector in India, it's all about scalability. And when you talk to these companies, you know, you talk to the largest companies in, in, in India, they will always say, okay, so this is, an, this is a very nice idea, can we scale it? Okay, and so they have a lot of experience in doing that. We have a lot of experience in innovating, finding new ways of thinking outside the box.